What is happening guys, it's your boy TC back with another video. So in this video we'll be discussing transfer talk as we all know, I call it silly season. It's extremely busy at the moment in terms of transfer news. Uh, we all know that Sanchez is most likely going to be heading for the exit door. Uh, his destination will certainly be Manchester, but which side of Manchester we don't know if it's going to be the blue or the red side. But a report surfacing this evening are suggesting that Manchester City have certainly dropped out of the race purely because they don't want to meet the asking price of £35 million, which will certainly rise to £40 million. Uh, that will also include agents' fees. So uh, reporters, as I said, are suggesting that Manchester City have definitely dropped out of the race. So his most likely destination will end up being Man United. Uh, I'm not too sure if that was his actual intended destination, but either way, he's going to be leaving the club. We all know that he hasn't signed a deal even if he leaves now or the summer uh, he's certainly going to be leaving I'm sick of this whole Alexis Sanchez situation I just need him to leave and uh, we can certainly start hating him if we do need to start hating on him but we also did have some memorable times with Alexis Sanchez as an Arsenal player so all the best to him if he does end up leaving in this particular transfer window so the purpose of this video is basically that Arsenal have been linked with a young 20 year old Brazilian winger by the name of Malcolm who currently plays for Bordeaux in France and he's certainly been lighting a French League up with his performances. So, so far this season, he has contributed to 11 goals in total. So, that's seven goals and four assists. And he does look brilliant, to be honest. But, obviously, I don't want to set my expectations high in terms of him being a direct replacement for Alexis Sanchez because, based on what I've seen and what I've watched uh, on Malcolm himself, he does have a little bit of developing to do over the years. But he's certainly not the finished article. But uh, I reckon he will certainly be able to fill the void for the next few months, obviously, whilst we round up the season. We are obviously approaching a crucial part of the season. And my own opinion on this particular matter in terms of replacing Sanchez is we do need to get a seasoned player. Uh, Malcolm will certainly be a massive, massive gamble. But until you buy the player, you never know how it's going to turn out. Uh, in particular, a good example is Richarlison, who's actually playing for Watford at the moment. He was bought in from Brazil, if I am correct for about 11 million pounds and he's definitely been worth every single penny of that so it doesn't really mean that if a player is young or is untested he certainly won't be able to perform it's just a massive gamble in my opinion so, so hopefully if we do end up signing the player it will turn out to be a very very good gamble so as i said uh malcolm plays for bordeaux is not capped for brazil at the moment but he's a fully fledged under 20 international for brazil and uh, as i said he looks absolutely fantastic however one damning stat really uh is uh, Memphis Depay if you do remember him played for Man United this season in the French League he's certainly got more goals and assists than Malcolm but teams are different they play around different players etc so I don't want to take that uh, too seriously I should say so Bordeaux apparently asking for 40 million pounds for the young player is he worth 40 million pounds we'll certainly only know once he definitely signs for the club as it stands he certainly may be worth 40 million quid uh, based on the transfer market as it is at the moment. But in my opinion, if he w if I was to conduct the deal, uh, I'll certainly maybe give 25 up front and then the, the rest will be made up in add-ons and clauses, etc. I would not pay £40 million up front for the young player. So I really don't know much about him apart from the fact that he's definitely uh, lighting the French League up. And he, he seems really good from what I've seen basically myself. So if you guys do know much about him or if you do know anything about Malcolm, please do let me know what you think in the comments below. Would, would he be a suitable replacement for Alexis Sanchez. Uh, if you do think so, again, as I said, please do let me know in the comments below. If you are watching this video and you're not subscribed to the channel, please do make sure that you do hit that subscribe button. So once again, guys, it's your boy TC from I'm Gonna Talk TV and I'm out.